assalamu alaikum welcome to medicine by chips so today we are uh, going to test the uh, functions of vestibular apparatus and uh, we will access the vestibular nystagmus so uh, first of all uh, we, uh, we should uh, know about the basic things Vest what is vestibular apparatus vestibular apparatus consists of three semicircular canals uh, secule and utricle secule and utricle they are together known as otolith organ and they provide the sense of linear acceleration whereas semicircular canals provide the uh, sense of angular acceleration uh, these are the basic things. Now we will perform the procedure accordingly. Now, uh, first I will take the concept of my subject, then I will perform the procedure. Assalamu alaikum, my name is Dr. Mehreen. So today I am going to uh, perform the procedure and I will check your eye movements. Now I will flex her head to 30 degrees and will rotate for 20 seconds towards the right. And I will ask her to, clo uh, to close her eyes. Then I will abruptly stop her and then check her nystagmus. So, Close her eyes. Open your eyes. Pull. So as we know, uh, nystig uh, normal nystigmus is normal. So uh, now I will uh, flex her head to the, uh, the right shoulder and will check the nystigmus. And then I will bend the, uh, her head to the left shoulder and then ag again I will check her nystigmus. The basic uh, difference between these two uh, uh, procedures is uh, in the first one uh, in which I flex her head to 30 degrees, uh, lateral canals of our vestibular apparatus are stimulated and now I will uh, flex her head to right and left to 30 uh, degrees on her shoulder. In this, uh, her vertical canals are stimulated. Basic difference is this. Now, open your eyes. Close your eyes. Open. Now, as you see, the stigmas is present. Now I will tilt her head on the left shoulder and uh, again I will uh, rotate her towards the right and her eyes will move towards the left. This is basically a nystigmus. Now, uh, now I will check her. Open your eyes. Close. Now open. So as you see, nystigmus is present and uh, uh, my subject is normal. And uh, uh, in the last, I will... Uh, uh, tell you some uh, precautions that you must take uh, during this procedure. The subject that who is uh, emotion sickness, who has emotion sickness, uh, 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 this is a condition in which the person is uh, experiences a nausea, vomiting, etc. You can't use that uh, patient or you can't uh, perform this procedure on that subject. So this was a precaution that you must consider during this procedure. Thank you. If you have any query, you can ask. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and share with friends. Thank you for watching. Allah Hafiz.